All right, Shalom. First and foremost, all praises and glories unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahushai, Bahashem, Harakakodash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of the great millstone who rule well. And greetings, salutations, and blessings unto the elect. Shalom unto you. I'm your brother Shaquan from Las Vegas Church and just want to uh, bring this article out. Okay. Um, it says, one in seven Americans have dumped friends who disagree with them on their stance of the, uh, uh, as you can read it, but on their stance on the, uh, the uh, uh, pandemic. Okay. And it just shows you the divide that's happening in this country. This place is crumbling. Okay. This place is crumbling. Matter of fact, before I get this, let me get this. Okay. So I'll, I'll go here. Um, and I'll start here with it. I mean, I didn't read the one in Matthew yet, but I'll read this one real quick. And this wasn't even the one that I was um, really looking for. But I'll start at Luke 12. And 51, suppose ye that I am come to give peace on earth, I tell you nay, but rather division. And you can see the division happening all over the uh, the earth as the spirit of the Lord. You know, the Harakakwadash, the Holy Spirit, is uh, increasing in the earth. We're also seeing uh, the, the, the mode or the, the mind state or the mentality of the people increasing. Okay, but it's increasing against each other and not in brotherly spirit as it once was. Okay, it says, uh, uh, for from henceforth there shall be five in one house divided, three against two and two against three. And you're seeing that, man. People don't don't know if they want to be uh, uh, um, drink the Kool-Aid or not. That's two. I think we shouldn't drink it. I think we should drink it. It's, it's the MOTB. It's not the MOT. It's just all of, all of these people divided up for for various reasons. But it's coming down to some serious, I'm Democrat, I'm Republican. It's all the same thing. But people aren't looking at the big picture. Okay? And people are truly divided in these times. Okay? It says the father shall be divided against the son. And the son against the father. The mother against the daughter. And the daughter against the mother. The mother-in-law against the daughter-in-law. And the daughter-in-law against the mother-in-law. Okay, people are truly divided out here. And this statistic that we're watching in the headline here from September the, the 14th, 2021, you know, on RT. Okay, as you see that, you can see, man, the people are truly divided. People protesting. People blaming each other. You're a super spreader. No, you're the super spreader. You're the one who's in. It's all your fault. We can't go back to normal life. And all these other things. Okay? A great division, man. Okay? Matter of fact, yeah, that was the one I was thinking. Okay, this is Luke 11. The one I was thinking. Luke 11. Uh, we'll start at uh, 17. This is the point that says, But he, knowing their thoughts, said unto them, Yahushai speaking, every kingdom divided against its, itself is brought to desolation, and a house divided against a house falleth. Okay? This division that we're seeing, people are dumping their friends, man, who disagree with them on their political stances, when they, they disagree with them on their, their pandemic uh, recommendation stances. Okay? There's all kinds of division going on in this country. And the, the best part is Egyptian against Egyptian. That's my favorite part. Okay. Verse 2, it says, And I will set the Egyptians against the Egyptians and the modern day Egyptians because the, the Egyptians had the Israelites in captivity over uh, you know centuries ago in ancient Egypt and now the modern day Egypt which this place in Revelation is called Sodom spiritually called Sodom in Egypt has the Israelites captive now 
And it, the scriptures in Baruch says we are yet this day in our captivity. So we're in captive under the, uh, the, the Egyptians right now. The modern day Egyptians are the Edomites now. It says, and they shall fight every one against his brother and every one against his neighbor, city against city and kingdom against kingdom. Okay. And this is what you're seeing. You're seeing red states versus the blue states. You're seeing um, uh, um, um, the north versus the south. Okay. You're seeing um, uh, pro-Trump versus pro-Biden. You know, and everybody's on Biden's head now. None of the Biden supporters want to even claim that they voted for this guy. Okay. They're the ones really divided, but they were all patriotic when they were getting him in there. Okay, now they're begging to have Trump back. It's crazy, man. Okay, and I don't need to go into this, the actual article. You know, you can go into it. Now, I don't want to mess around and read something that'll get this struck anyway. In fact, I got another one that I'm thinking of. Let's go to, um, let's go to second address. Um, classic one. I'll start here. Yep. Um I read I restart at fifteen. For the sword and their destruction second letter fifteen and fifteen. For the sword and their destruction draweth nigh, showing you the times we're in, and one people shall stand up to fight against another. Yeah, this thing is gonna get serious because they're dumping people with this now, but there's a great divide that's happening anyway. Okay? The V's versus the the unvies. Okay? It's crazy, man. But but this is the spirit that the Lord has prophesied will, will, will be happening in, in these days. Okay? One people should stand up to fight against another and swords in their hands. Now, it starts off this way, but it's going to end up in, in, in real, in real um, clashing. Okay? It says, uh, talks about a sedition among men, but this part here. Uh, 19, I'm going to jump down. It says, a man shall have no pity upon his neighbor. Okay. Yeah. So they're going to, they're not going to have a, a, a problem being veed or drinking the Kool-Aid and or the pimp juice or whatever. And then going next door because there's no food or the, 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 the famine and the food shortages and economic collapse. Not going to have a problem going next door and strong arming your buddy next door, you know. For, for their food. Okay. It says. Uh, a man shall have no pity upon his neighbor. But shall destroy their houses. With the sword. The modern day sword is the gun. Okay. And spoil their goods. Because of the lack of bread. No food. And for great tribulation. All the trouble going on. Hey man. I just want to get back to normal. That's what we're hearing now. I just want to get things back to normal. It ain't going back to normal. But these people that, that, that have drank the Kool-Aid. They really believe it's going to go back to good like it once was. Okay. Get another couple. Um, um, yeah, I'll get this one particularly. Matthew 6. So I'm here already. Yep. Michael 6, uh, Second Address 6, verse 24. It says, At that time shall friends fight one against another like enemies. Okay, and people are going to fight, man. People are about to fight one against another like enemies. And the earth shall stand in fear with those that dwell therein. Uh, the springs of the fountains shall stand still and in three hours they shall not run. Yeah, but the main point was, and at that time, friends shall fight one against another like enemies. Okay, we're seeing it. You're dumping your friends, ghosting them. Don't want to call him back. Just say, I'm not calling this guy back till he gets it done. You know, or he's done. I can't be around him. I don't want to get infected by him. You see, and I'll wrap it up with this one. Um, where else are you? How was I? Um, Matthew 24 is around 11 or so. Yep. And I'll say this Matthew 24 and 10. And then shall many be offended. And shall betray one another. And shall hate one another. Okay. Verse 12. And because iniquity shall abound. 
the love of many shall wax cold. Yeah, we're watching the world wax cold between the people of the earth, man. Not just in country versus country either. Egyptian against Egyptian. You know, Edomite against Edomite. Jake versus Jake. Poor versus poor. Rich versus rich. We're seeing, you know, politician versus politician. We're watching all these different levels of a great divide happen in these last days. Okay? We're watching it happen. All right? And this is all prophecy proven that, that our time is coming, that we're going to re be uh, removed out of this prison, man. This spiritual prison, this physical prison, this mental prison. Okay? This punishment, man. That our Lord and Savior is going to come and rescue us, man. Okay? So I just want to bring that out. You guys can go check this out. This is on RT.com. It's under USA News. One in seven uh, um, Kool-Aid drinkers, Kool-Aid drinking Americans have dumped friends who disagree with them on the pandemic, um, you know, potion uh, polls show. Okay, I'd like to see if there is a um, look at this. See? Getting scolded by the president. They're not scolding him enough. They were trying to bring down these draconian laws, man. They got <laughs> full-blown, okay? Pause to read this if you need to. But these are some of the, the, some of the statistics. Okay? All right. You can see this stuff. All right. All right. All them shitheads. Wow. <laughs> yeah, they're really pushing hard, man. But watch. Watch. We know that we're not supposed to get uh, maxed out. Okay? We're not supposed to do that. We're not supposed to prick our skin. Okay? We're not supposed to be... In, and then we know what's in this potion. It's all things that, that's going to kill our people, man. That's, that's that It's all transgressions of the Lord and witchcraft, man. So we know not to follow a multitude to do that, to do evil, to, 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 to transgress the laws knowingly. Yeah, we knowingly know because we've, we've studied what was in it. They gave us the answers of what was in it. It's just a Google search. Blue crab shell and uh, uh, newborn fetus and all that. Man, come on. But the point being, people are being divided on their belief and their, their stance. And TikTok has got the most... <laughs> You know, YouTube is censoring a lot, but the Internet's got it, man. You just got to do your do your diligent search, man. All right? So, anyway, this place is falling, man. Okay? Uh, as I read in uh, Luke 11, man, uh, for, for a country be divided, uh, for, for a city or whatever be divided against itself, it, it shall not stand. So, anyway, Lord willing, this was that a final give all praise and glories unto Yahweh. Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Harakak, Wadash. Double honor to the apostles and the elders of the great millstone. Greetings, salutations, and blessings on to you. Like, until the next one, shalom.